welcome back for the first time to Missing Hiker. Now, this is a game I found on Steam in which your brother went hiking and is now missing and you have to find him. Will it be scary? Vamos a ver, muchachos. Let's check it out. December 11th, 1994. My brother Ethan is missing for around 24 hours. He went on a hiking trip near the Red Mountain. He should have come home yesterday. I went to the local police. They said they don't have a resor the resources. Blah, blah, blah. They said they don't have the resources for a search right now. So I decided to take matters into my own hands. Oh, here I go. Oh, I get to drive it. All right, I can, I can control it. Oh, look, the, the thing about if your brother goes missing on a hike and you have to go out and search for him, like at least have a plan. What do you uh, go throughout during the day? What are you doing going there at night while it's snowing? The only thing that's gonna happen is you're gonna get lost too. Like, what are you gonna do at night? That's all I want to know. Uh, you expect to find him huh, with your headlights? Do you know if, if if you were using your car, then you're probably gonna be on a public road, which means that your brother would have most likely been found by somebody else. So what? You're gonna use a flashlight? All right, then you're gonna go in the forest and it's gonna be dark and then it's gonna be scary. It's gonna be lots of monsters and then you don't have a crucifix to ward off the demons and shit. And then you're gonna be stupid. And you're gonna die. So what? It, it, it makes no sense. Wait, 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 wait! No, you could crash. <laughs> you see what I mean? Por pendejo. This is what happens when you try to drive at night in the snow and go search for your brother in the mountains. This is dangerous. Like, and especially if you, like, keep going off the uh, off the side of the road like that, like, you're going the opposite, the wrong way. Like, learn how to drive, dude. I hope you filled up your gas, too, because if you're out of gas, then you're going to be stuck in the middle of the road without any gas. And then, oh, there's a gas station coming up ahead. Look at that guy. Okay, he's cool. He didn't want to stop and help me look for my brother. Psh, you know, maybe I should carry a sign that says, help me look for my brother. Might as well do that. It's useless. It's useless. I should park at this gas station and ask if they saw my brother. Dog. Alright, look. I know you're desperate and stuff. But, like... If you're a gas station worker, you probably don't remember half the people that come in. Unless they're real suspicious. Then you start remembering them. Oh, I'm tall as shit, bro. Look at my look at my head height. I'm almost about to knock over that the top of this door right here. Hola, buenas tardes. Hey, yo, you seen my bro? What do you want? I'm searching for my brother. He went missing while hiking in this area. Sorry to offend you, pal, but that's not my problem. Look, dog, try not to talk to people with suits because most of them have a chip on their shoulder like this. Also, you shouldn't just randomly approach people like, why the f*** not? I'm looking for my bro, dog. Especially in this area. <laughs> what do you mean? Hey, look, man, I worked pretty late. I just want to grab some snacks and beer and drive home. I'm not in the mood to talk with people I don't know. Uh, I understand. Sorry for bothering you. Man, just f f f f keep annoying him. Press E on this fool. You know what? Block his car. You know, hold up. Let me see. Can I get back in my car? Drive it through real quick. Commit some sort of crime tonight. I'm down for it. Can I get in here, drive, and just run right through here? Just, just right on that fool. Grab a can of beans, throw it at his head. Mexican style. Puto, pa que se te quite, cabrón. Talking shit. Thank you. Don't talk to me. Come that way. What's up? Hey, um, what can I do for you, sir? I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking around this area. Uh, he should have come home yesterday. Have you seen him? How does your brother look like? Uh, what do you mean, how does he look like? He, he has brown hair and is pretty tall. He also has a green backpack. Let me think for a second. Uh, mm, yes, I think I saw your brother. He came in here and bought a few things, some water and a few snacks. Uh, you're trying to find him? Have you told the police already? Yeah, I did, in fact, but they said they don't have the resources for a search right now. They said they only start a search if a person is missing for more than 48 hours. Man, for, dog, this is, like, for missing people, I, I'm, I'm assuming this kind of shit goes on. Like, oh, they have to be missing for a certain amount of time before we can do anything. Like, by the time the police start... They're probably in danger or dead. It isn't the first time someone went missing in this area. At least a handful of people went missing there in the last decade. People talk a lot. I've heard rumors that there are strange screams and weird noises coming from the woods. So you should be careful, especially going there at this time of night. There's a road right behind the gas station leading to the mountain. Make sure you stay on it. It could be dangerous wildlife in that area. Like El Chupacabra? Mm -hmm. 
All right, fool, that's actually good information. Thank you very much. I'm out of here. Adios, pendejo, idiota, loser. I hope you continue to be annoyed and your job sucks and you live a miserable life. <laughs> be nice to people. How about that? How about just being courteous? Oh, wait. F if I'm taking... He said take the road behind the... Get in your car. What? Nuh uh you're going to make me go to the behind that road that's behind the gas station, go up the thing, and potentially run into the chupacabra on foot? I mean, I could try to whoop his ass, but it's not probably not going to end up working out. He sucks on cows and goats. I don't want him to suck on me. I'm a lot more fragile than a cow and a goat. Uh, goats are scary. Have you ever tried to headbutt one of them? It leaves a mark. Rattles your entire cerebral spine serum. Yeah, I don't know what I'm on tonight. Like... <laughs> <laughs> I just been drinking water. I would take I took my vitamins today. I ate well. I'm in a good mood. This is I'm just, I'm just just want to find my brother at the top of this mountain. That's all. I'm hyped too. Okay, uh, I could have run. I could have been running this whole time, but I want to take it slow just in case. Just in case something comes out, you know, I don't want to run into it. I want to see it from afar and then be like, "Oh, yep, turn around." Mm -hmm. Hola. Buenas tardes, se encuentra por aquí un pinche chupacabra, el cucuy, la llorona, la mano pachona or something. Oh, something spooky over there. Go. Hermano, is that you, my bro, with the green backpack and the brown hair? My brother's tent looks entirely different. I should still take a closer look. Okay, that's probably not your brother's tent, and there's probably a, like a gay couple in there or something, bro. You don't want to interrupt, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna see shit. You ain't supposed to be seeing. Knock, knock, bitch. I can't knock on a tent. It's gonna sound like nothing. It's gonna sound like pants unzipping when you knock on a tent. I thought I heard something. He said, Silence the road! Oh my shit, I just clicked through the dialogue! Ah! I should have stayed on the road! Look! You bothered the gay people! God damn it. What do you want? Hope you're not some kind of pervert or a creep. Well, I'm not. I'm just searching for my brother. He's hiking in this area. Have you seen him? Nope. I haven't seen him. Wait. You don't even know what he looks like. Look, man. I'm just some guy that likes to hike in the woods and sleep in a tent in freezing conditions. I haven't seen anyone in days. Dog, you're like literally like two minutes. Like a two minute, less than a two minute walk from a gas station. What do you mean you haven't seen anyone in days? You're planning to go deeper into the forest? Yes, I'll search around the area. I hope I can find my brother, or at least traces of him. That, that's sinister, bro. That's kind of... Pff. Look, you probably think I'm a stoner or something. But last night, I had my tent a bit up north. And I heard weird noises coming from the woods. It sounded like a child was crying, but I didn't see anything. Okay, look, if these are Mexican woods, it's probably just a kid getting hit by their parents. Okay, sometimes we have to get disciplined. A chancla gets thrown around, you can hear it all the way across the woods. They might not even be in the woods, they might just be in the neighborhood around the woods. You'll hear it. You'll hear that shit. You know how you hear Mexican party music on Friday nights in your neighborhood? You also hear the sounds of children screaming at chanclas being thrown at them when their mom is yelling at them. <laughs> it's kind of dark, bro. Alright, it creeped me out. Maybe it was a, 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 a what? Look, man. Do you carry? What do you mean? I'm talking about a piece, you know? Something for protection. Ah, ah. You mean like a... Like that, like a... Like, I see what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, you mean a gun. No, I don't. Then you shouldn't be here in the first place. It's way too dangerous to go deeper into the forest at night. But I'm not going to stop you. I just want to sleep now. Also, one last thing. Don't creep up in a tent of woods at night ever again. I I said that. I I tried telling him, dog. I tried telling him. I almost would have shot you. You know, my boyfriend is sleeping in there. Well, I guess I'm glad you didn't. Me too. Good luck with the search. <laughs> hey, listen, man. I'm sorry I interrupted. Continue. Carry on. I'm gonna keep going this way, and I'm gonna go straight up the road, and I'm gonna try not to deviate from the road ever again. Thanks uh, for the information. Te aprecio. Appreciate it. Uh, the gracias. I think we were going this way. That jump scare was f***ed up, bro. Okay, he said there was a um 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 a thing. 
in the woods. And I should have carried a gun with me, he said. But I don't have a gun, so what am I going to do? If I hear a child crying, bro, what do you think I'm going to do, man? That's scary. Ain't no Mexican neighborhoods around here. What the f I'm going to stay on the road. I'm going to keep going up the mountain. And when I see another light, then I'll go towards the light. Never knock on random people's tents at night. Oh, God, please. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. I'm scared. I feel like something's going to pop up and scare me right here. And I don't like it, muchachos. No me gusta nada esta madre, güey. Aquí me va a salir un vato. Otro pinche vato, un monstruo. Me va a comer. Me va a chupar la sangre. Y voy a terminar flaco. Más flaco. Hello. Oh god, it's getting spooky. I know. It's getting spooky. A little spooky. It's getting really cold. I should set up a tent on the left side of the road. Seriously, put a tent up right here. Press E to place a tent. My fingers are pretty numb. It's hard to build a tent. I should have brought the car. There was plenty of room on that road for a car. Press E to enter the tent. Oh god, really? I'm in the- I'm in my tent. It's cold, but I'm falling asleep slowly. For real? I think I heard someone scream. Not sure if that was real or imagined. Get your ass up. I need to check. It could be my brother screaming for help. Oh, get your flashlight. Bendejo, get your flashlight up. Where, where did he go? Deeper in the woods. I need to see if I can go, if it could be my brother. What do you mean, deeper in the woods? Where? It sounds like it's this way. Right? I see something glowing over there. Yeah, there's something glowing. Right over there. Don't tell me that's the gas station. There's some, there's like a house in the middle of the woods over there. Hell no. Texas Chainsaw Massacre about to happen right now. And it's going to be just me from Texas getting massacred. Hermano, on this does way? The f bro? This ain't even hiking. This is like level ground. What do you mean? Oh, God. Oh, what was that? My flashlight just flickered. There's demons in this game. There's ghosts. I thought there was probably going to be like kidnapping and cannibals or some shit, man. But like, the shit flickered. You know, that ain't natural. Okay. Oh, there's a green backpack. Backpack's completely empty. Nothing's in here. He got jacked, bro. <laughs> this is the bad side of the woods. You know what I'm saying? This is where you pull up. You get your shit taken and your ass kicked. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. I have to go inside this house. I don't want to go inside this house. Can I please skip the part where I go inside this house? How do I go in there? Shut up. Shut up. Yo, sh sh shut up. I thought I thought it was a fence. Okay, it looked like a fence from the angle I was at, and I thought the whole fence just ran over the whole fence. <laughs> shut up, man. <laughs> Alright, let's go in there. <laughs> hey, bro, you in here, fool? Hello? Buenas tardes. Ha llegado su mejor amigo, el mexorcista. I was cara mi hermano. I'm not even here to like do no demon shit, do no exorcisms this time. I'm really just looking for my brother. What the hell? Someone took a picture of my tent and my car. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro, you showed up at the wrong fucking place. You came to the wrong place, man. Hello! Oh god. Oh, I just noticed. There's blood and shit. I'm screwed. Someone's about to grab me. Someone's about to grab me. There's someone out there. Hey! The f he was waiting at the door. Your body was never found. Is there multiple endings? Can I do something different? Get out of here, fool! Hey, rich boy, come out! I bet you won, motherfucker! Run your ass over, bitch! Let's go! Okay, I can't run him over. Uh, that's, that's fine. I just had to try. I had to try. Okay, that's <laughs> that's it.
<laughs> Thank you so much for watching uh, Hiker Missing Hiker. If you enjoyed my trip behind the 7-Eleven, leave a like. Let me know down in the comments what you want to see next. I'm glad it was not the Chupacabra and it turned out to just be some random ass fools in the woods. But that's it for me. I love you guys and I'm going to see you next time. Bye.